Hi! Have you ever wondered what goes on inside the reproductive organ of a female pig? And ask as to how they could have such a large litter size? Well, it's time for us to get a closer look at that pig factory down there. In female pigs, the reproductive system is located in the pelvic cavity dorsal to the intestines. However, in this video, we will begin externally with the vulva. The vulva is the terminal and external genitalia of the female animals endowed with blood vessels. It comprises the right and left labia, which meet on the dorsal and ventral midline at the rounded dorsal commissure and ventrally in more pointed ventral commissures. In gilts, the vulva is often observed to swell and change color near the time of estrus. These swelling and color change are not as evident in sows or gilts, and color changes are not observable in dark-skinned pigs. Vagina is the portion of the reproductive tract that lies within the pelvis between the uterine cranially and the vulva caudally, together with vulva and vestibule, which constitutes the copulatory organ of the female. Vagina serves as the birth canal during parturition and it usually receives the penis of the male during copulation. In ruminants, vagina acts as the receptacle for the seminal fluid. While in dog, pig, and horse, the semen is usually deposited in the cervical canal or directly into the uterus. In pig, Vagina is 10 to 12 centimeters long and relatively thin walled tube extending longitudinally inside the pelvic cavity, dorsally to the rectum and ventrally to the urinary bladder and urethra. The cervix is a short canal that is 1 centimeter long and projects caudally into the vagina, but the tissue's thickening extends beyond the external ostium as a fold of the vagina. Cervix is a heavy, smooth muscle sphincter that is tightly closed except during estrus and parturition. During estrus, the cervix relaxes slightly, allowing spermatozoa to enter the uterus. Cervix of a sow measures 15 to 20 cm long and has 8 mm thick wall. It opens gradually into uterus and vagina without noticeable demarcation. The inner surface of the cervix is arranged in a series of circular ridges or rings, sometimes called annular folds. The uterus is the highly expandable tubular organ where the fetus and the embryo develops. It acts as a passageway for sperm to reach the oviduct and are the site of fetal development. The uterus of the domestic mammal consists of a body, a cervix or a neck, and two horns. The uterine tube or ovida is a narrow muscular tube which conveys the oocytes released from the ovary to the uterus. Each tube is suspended by the mesosulfates. The ovaries of domestic mammals are oval or round, firm in consistency and often nodular or tuberculate as a result of protruding follicles. They are paired glands usually found in the lumbar region of the abdominal cavity, a short distance caudal to the kidneys. Like all abdominal organs, the ovaries are covered with peritoneum. They are suspended from the body wall by the mesovarium, the most cranial part of the peritoneal investments of the female genital tract. In pigs, ovaries are about 5 cm long and very uneven due to many follicles and corpora lucha on the surface which is located slightly ventrolateral to the pelvic inlet and usually found hidden among the intestines. <laughs> 